plus um, yeah maybe some kind of like sketch maybe I don't I don't know but yeah apparently it's like that oh wait a minute okay <laughs> but I need to set up my camera okay hello guys you are now in Odeng oh, Arch live sharing session so we're gonna go in through some InDesign portfolio thing while designing so yeah let's go to the opening So, uh, sorry. <laughs> oh. Oh. Wait the minute. Oh, then that's full view. Sorry. I'm just trying to a bit like adjusting because there's something happening there. Okay. Whoa. Okay. On online setup version two. Full online setup. Okay. So where are we before? Hmm daily oh the research 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 center Arch daily animal research animal shelter that bio diver City research BT biodiversity and aquatic biodiversity tech Touch Museum and Biodiversity Research Gallery and Museum of Biodiversity Museum and Biodiversity Okay we have like four case study to going to go through Sorry if I'm blocking Chi. <laughs> okay, so mm, this is like <coughs> this is a project with BT Biodiversity Center. Okay. So wait, is there any plan? We need to examine if the plan is kind of like with labeling, yeah. We proceed. Whoa. <laughs> wow. Very artistic. But I couldn't digest. Okay, that's okay. We just try to set some kind of like a key point to this. Oh, -ho. so the BT Biodiversity Center and the Aquatic Ecosystem, uh, a new campus person organized around generous exterior courtyard spaces, which is bisected by new cross campus pedestrian and bicycle connection. The principal exhibition space of museum located to BT Glass Lantern. The BT Biodiversity Center comprises a natural history museum. Wow. Sorry, I know. We need to open some kind of music before that. Low. Low feet. Yeah. This is our jam. Mm, 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 mm. 1100 11,500 square meter. The glass lantern, the extensive natural history. Wow, I like the idea of having like 
showing the the bones the aquatic research uh, consolidate interdisciplinary research group around an ethereum that interconnects the four the social space allocated adjacent to the ethereum academic for the student community and variety of meeting spaces are located to upper floor while the large public room are located on the ground where pacific the urban life Ooh. the atrium also natural ventilation ventilation stack that pulls air into the building okay i don't know no comment but <laughs> i like the idea of having like yeah this kind of thing showing the bones but shamely the plan didn't kind of detail it's hard for you to read it out see it's like very i don't know very just a presentation wise now i know what is the best about Ash Daily? Oh. Well, architect calling for action on climate change. Wow! BIG reveals skyscraper design for the project in South America. Touch Museum. I don't know, Museum is might be nice. For, for this oh, oh. I, know, I feel so sleepy after it <laughs> touch cover both wall and roof I like this design though this design is very very I don't know it's my kind of jam thing designed by French studio Guini Potinakita who spent his career studying the birds inside plant mammal that he found during travel across France. <laughs> wow. It's located in the former ground of biologist George Duran. Oh. oh, this is very nice. I like it though. The architect have renovated the existing three-story house and extended it by adding single story structure story structure with a touch exterior ooh touch exterior daring they also develop a landscape strategy for the ground include create a diverse local ecosystem wow see it's like and then ele elevate the project is neither a theme park nor an ornamental garden. They explain this really is site specific project inspired by local biodiversity, the topography, and the other qualities that are proper B2. See, see, see? The column, I don't know, like, try to zoom in. See? Wait, is there any, like, pen on desktop? pen tool I just wanna like indicate though pen pen setting <coughs> best screen pen annotation Presentation point, uh, yeah, presentation mark. Hmm. Windows snip me, annotate pro. I don't know, the screen marker is very simple. By now, portable USB.
what I want is yeah, live oh, live drawing on screen, full screen zoom, electronic whiteboard, mark freely on screen. Okay lah, this is what we want though. Hmm. <laughs> it's like every second doesn't waste <laughs> my I need the one that free though close close screen annotate presentation marker free version line drawing feature allowed to draw wow line drawing screen annotation screen annotation Free screen annotation. I want live annotation. Slide mate does this. Slide mate. Yeah, it's like very simple. I don't know why. Everything need to buy. Screen annotation. Free screen annotation. <laughs> Free pen eraser highlighter. Yeah, this is what we want. Sixteen color whiteboard blackboard there. <laughs> Install <laughs> So funny It's like Launch epic pen I like the idea of pen line pen pen. What what is the comment? Control shift four. Oh, so I like the idea of woo <laughs> of like uh there's it's like uh circulation can be entered there. Reserve control shift five. Woo woo hoo. Wow, what we have more text cursor? Oh, it's a cursor thing in invisible. Who control shift one? Oh, oh, pen size. Oh, I like very thick one. Undo control shift six, clear screen control shift seven, whiteboard control shift w. Take a screenshot. Ooh, now we're talking. Ooh, I like this. I like this though. Control Shift Six to undo. Wow, now I'm a pro. Highlighter. So it's like the circulation can be enter, and then Control Shift Seven cursor. Oh, Control Shift Seven. So about. 
about this mm, the touch screen contrast with the Duran Mansion architect yeah told this in the building grow organically embracing the mansion spreading out the side without overthrowing the nature of the yeah it's true I like the material though touch the building is raised off ground on wooden pillar reducing its impact on the landscape uh, allowing space underneath for shallow pond Ooh, see the interior like wow. making the building rise up on the ground allow biodiversity to stay in place saying the architect the project slowly lift up to unveil the pond hosting frog and herons the wooden ram leads visitor into the both new and old part of the complex while the old house accommodate research Ooh. the new wing contain permanent temporary exhibition space okay this is this is the thing that we need to need to say museum and biodiversity <coughs> this is like <coughs> main idea is uh, yeah seven for 70 years he collected plant and insight from all over the Europe with the help of his friend and fellow scientists here's how he was able to collect nearly 5,000 birds 150,000 butterfly and insect and yeah, yeah yeah it's just one sample one sample the project aimed to develop educational scientific support biodiversity and management and evolution perspective for the whole area beyond the thematic garden composing using rainwater for watering or oh. there are some obvious action the project aim to help new form of biodiversity to regenerate this site abandoned for 30 years some plot of land have reached a state of climax and the global intervention prevent two alternatives either an integral preserva preservation either a minimal intervention that could engage a new natural diversification some other plot on the contrary have maintained in a state of biology poverty due to frequent mowing and pasture yeah true these ones could use a higher level of interventionism in order for a new ecosystem to settle on a long-term basis tries to write fine balance between light action preserving the biodiversity already on site other stronger action creating positive impact on biodiversity thus the project is neither a theme park nor an ornamental garden true this this really is a site specific project inspired by local biodiversity and the topography and other qualities that are proper to be to the visit itinerary is drawn by this logic scientific purpose leading the visitor down the field and the valley where the wild nature meet them both beautiful historical and newly designed garden and meadow wow this is nice in a very present landscape green setting the project takes on strong identity reinterpreting traditional technique in contemporary and innovative way by adopting touch scheme that entirely cover both wall and roof of the building the competition rendering display the natural aging of material fading to gray tone and shade changing as season pass by who i like this the building grows organic, embracing dimension. Oh. Making the building rise up the ground, allow the basic to, to stay up in place and minimize the impact. Yeah, see? Mm. I don't know, it's like repeating though the word. A pedagogical greenhouse stand next to its entrance at the entrance of the site. Ooh, it's like going through. Control shift 7 Control shift 1 
global approach how to combine bio bioclimatic design and contextual approach considering the program environment and biodiversity are the lead motif words would concentrate on being as compact as possible in order to prevent the thermic loss but in context of beauty where the mansion even in ruins stand quite impressive from the first visit it has been chosen not to go in this way and add a second massive building but instead to design a stretch shape laying over 100 meters from our point of view this contextual approach compensate the idea of bracket shame shape follow this principle light impact on the surrounding by using natural touch and raising the building on the steel lowering the impact of foundation work solar soft facade generally open landscape and circulation concentrate on northern side solar soft facade maximal in factory prefab phase allowing a clean construction site and low environment disturbance yeah i think the idea to make a building at natural need to have like uh, like factory prefabrication given the existing ground and minimize concrete foundation the extension is built on the private prefab timber frame allowing a control during the fabrication with high precision assembly technique and a high internal flexibility in the future the use of composite timber concrete oh, timber concrete floor opposite for the low inertia of timber structure health is kept inside in winter but the attached roof and wall 25 cm on roof 25 cm on wall prevent its penetration in summer concern the existing mansion it rehabilitates in patrimonial way restoration of all window floor and timber frame with coated with light gray lime plaster Ooh. lime plaster inside the mansion existing floor has been conserved and original cement tile and has been relocated and mixed with contemporary piece to create an ambiguous on what is and what has been the pronounced touch overhang in associate with existing duress tree hedge create a solar protection from direct sun during the summer well i think this in is more boiler who i like this the safe it's a simple idea of i don't know i need to look at the section and plan i don't know actually it's like <laughs> sorry to say but <laughs> it's proven that design is more more detailed for now for this biodiversity thing Oh my god, I like this building though. And just that the reason of you see, it's like contrast between wait. Control Shift 4. Control Shift 4. So it's like contrast between this and this. You see? It's like low scale and then high scale. Control 7. Control shift one. Ah, my brain is already. Oh, I feel a bit dizzy. So yeah, this is another case study. <laughs> it's like in this in design we do the case study thing. Yeah, I, uh, it's okay. I just. Oh, oh, it's a gift. Click for larger image. Wow, it's a GIF. Thank you for giving me gift. Wait, we need to make some folder for it. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. 
mm-hmm. Museum Di- Biodiversity City Center Center Guini Potin Gue ni potin architects. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we now saving things up. Sorry, I need to mm-hmm. Oh, I like the They were so cool that they just Oh, the blending with side it's like I think our project we need to be like showing this kind of stuff though the interior oh my god wow oh, I like the opening though simple you see the exhibitions simple yet yeah. it's very I don't know, very nicely done, especially for the interior, like, oh, well done, well done. I know I like the the way that they make the walkway. It's like uh, it's like uh, preventing from hitting the tree. Though we we need to study the plan after this. Seeing this marvelous project, if you're not looking into the plan, I don't know. I just know. I don't know, might be that the image is overlapping section but I don't know the plan doesn't detect the plan though where is the plan okay we got the section got the section detail and, oh. oh this is really also having having it Greeny, greenet popping. Wow, this is the image before though. Okay, okay. Is there any plan? Forty-two picture. Man. See the house ready. It's ready. Mm-hmm. 
Wait, I need the plan though. Okay, now ideally is more better. <laughs> Ooh. Wow, the top elevation is like top perspective is like wow. I like the research area. Wow, we have the jetpack. The detail plan. <gasps> the detail side plan. Okay, now I would say that actually is more better. very concise oh i like the section with leveling it respect people whoa got render oh the timber construction i would give an a plus okay huh. I need to drink water for the next session. Okay, so oh damn, fullness. That's it, guys. So thank you for watching. Oh. Okay, guys. Thank you for watching. Oh dang, arch live sharing session. So we're gonna continue. Like I don't know. I'm gonna take a break. Like. 10 or 15 minutes then we continue so for those who doesn't know me i'm odeng arch and i'm doing my master part two uh, just now semester two <laughs> and yeah if you like this video please press the like on the button below and if you feel that um, uh, this video is knowledgeable to anyone um, please yeah, I don't mind. Please share it to your friends or family. It means a lot to me. And yeah, I end this video with peace. Yo. Wow. See you guys in the next video. Where's our ending? is now live.